Hey guys, I'm Kim and welcome to Angel Wings Aquatics. <laughs> These are just a few of my tanks. Most of my tanks are spread out throughout multiple bedrooms. So I'm just going to show you a few and we're going to touch on a couple of subjects and projects that we're going to go through. One subject is of Hurricane Dorian. Hurricane Dorian just went through our coast here on Florida. So I'll go through power outages and how to get through those safely with your fish tanks. So be looking for that on my YouTube channel. Be sure to like and subscribe to it. You will see a lot more of me. So our first tank that I'm gonna show you is my 30 gallon. This tank is the one with my orange tailed Dalmatians on uh, mollies, which you can hardly see. So I'll just back the camera back up. This is the one that I bought the breeder box for. Unfortunately, when I got home, my females already had their babies. So, so much for that one. Uh, guess I'll have to wait for the next batch, but it's okay because I have a tank ready and waiting for them, which those are over here. These are my two grow out tanks. This one is for my mollies. And this one is for my peacock gudgeons, which I currently have some eggs sort of tumbling, so to say, in this PVC pipe. They are darkening up, which is a good sign because they're coming close to the hatching. So I'm super excited about this tank right here. There's definitely more to come with this tank. I will show you more to come with this tank once I get some baby mollies in here. My next project that I'm going to be covering this coming weekend on my YouTube channel and on my Facebook is going to be this guy. This guy is my green Texas cichlid, better known as beast mode. Beast mode doesn't feel like coming out right now. He's just kind of chilling there. You see my four year old just trying to be in involved in everything. Say hi, Sky. Hi. <laughs> so all this is waiting for is his stand. I have a stand that will fit a 40 gallon breeder that I'm going to upgrade him to. For now, all I have is a 30 gallon breeder, but I'm going to finish that this weekend. So in a week, I will show you how to switch this tank without having to cycle the new tank, so to say. You still have to be very, very careful with it. It is not suggested to move tanks or add fish without cycling a tank. But I will show you how, to, how I do it this coming weekend. So look forward to that. Be sure to visit my YouTube. I will be posting this video on YouTube, on my YouTube channel as well. That's Angel Wings Aquatics. Be sure to like and subscribe. Peace out, and I look forward to seeing you again. Tank on, my friends. <laughs>